Open these doors, outsider! You can't get away! The defacement of the church must have happened many months ago. Just give yourself up, outsider. The order will have mercy on your rotten soul. If you're willing to come out now, there's a raised section of tiling in the baptismal pool. Give yourself up, outsider. There's no way out of there. Open these doors, outsider! You can't get away! I should let the bell finish ringing first. You're trapped. There's no place you can run. I should let the bell finish ringing first. Just give yourself up, outsider. The order will have mercy on your rotten soul. I should let the bell finish ringing first. If you're willing to come out now, we'll not gut the gals, darkness. Give yourself up, outsider. There's no way out of there. There are markings everywhere. It must have been down here that Rebecca's father figured out that mysterious sign. It's a registry of births, deaths, and marriages in Innsmouth. They all appear to be volumes on the history of Innsmouth. A small stone plaque engraved with a series of numbers. The postcard fits exactly over the plaque. I can see some of the numbers. It appears to be some sort of code. It's the coffin of Tom Pickett, who it's the coffin of D. Slocum, who died in 1852, aged 27. Yes, yes, that's it. The safe holds a stone cross. There's a small stone disc here, hollowed out with the carving of an upside down cross. I don't need the cross anymore.
Some of the planks look weak. I better watch my step. Some of the planks look weak. I'd better watch my step.
shit. Some of the planks look weak. I'd better watch my step. An old chest of drawers. Search Nothing of interest. Spread out. An old chest of drawers. Nothing of interest. Search the area. Search the area. Hello, Jack. Mackie, have you been tailing me? You could say that. Drop me a line next time you're planning on taking the stealthy approach. I'll watch and take notes. Funny. I don't get it, Mackie. What's your angle on all of this? I already told you. I work for the government. I've got friends at the top. Friends who've invested a lot of time and dough in Innsmouth. They don't want to see their investigation set back by some private op turning up the heat with some mindless caper. If you mean the Burnham boy, they're gonna kill him, Mackie. You know it, and I know it. I can't let that happen. You're not thinking of breaking him out. He's just a punk, Jack. Where's the jailhouse, Mackie? Very well. It's your funeral. The window over there to your left looks over the jail back alley. See you around, Mackie. Decorative vases, it won't budge. What was that? Probably nothing.
Okay. He's over there. Anything to report? Nope. We should be out there, Nathan. Helping with the hunt. You have your orders for to stay with the sacrifices. They'll yield us much favor with the order. I, uh, think, uh, The Chief's always up to napping. Why ain't he out here with us? His time draws nigh. Martin can't strategize properly no more. He'll take to the water. Then it'll be me taking charge around here, and things will be got different. Now get inside, and mind that you don't forget to bolt the door. A crowbar? That could come in handy. Back here would be a great hiding spot. Who's there? I can hear you. <laughs> Shh! I'm a private detective. My name's Jack Walters. I'm looking for Burnham. Look, fella, I'm Burnham. What the hell is it you want? Why did you knock off the First National and the Variety Store? What? I'm the manager of First National. Why the blazes would I rob my own store? They haven't even charged me with anything. Look, just clear off before you get me in trouble. Garrison spots you, he'll scream this joint down. Garrison? Yeah, Henry Garrison. He's the crazy fellow in the next cell. Whenever he throws a fit, one of Martin's mom are all over this alley like a rash. Especially tonight. They seem incredibly twitchy, much more than usual. <sighs> I see your eyes at the window. I remember Henry. Henry. Don't move, outsider. Who torments me now? Look everywhere! Why? 
find your search! You'll not get there. You, Jack, deep in the water shows no mercy. Beyond the wreath of Satan it lies. Why on it lay? to the cells. Now I can free Brian. What is it you really do? Bring it in, Smith Jack. You ready to break out of this joint? Why should I trust you? What? In case you hadn't noticed it, fella, you're in a bit of a jam here. It could be a trap. Are you crazy? Stop bothering me! Ruth Billingham gave me this. What? This is the photograph I gave her before. before. Oh, damn. I've been so foolish. I'm sorry. If Ruth trusts you, Jack, then so do I. Please, hurry and get this door open! It's unlocked. The garage on the main street holds an old automobile. It should be able to get us clear of town. Should be able to? Yes. We just make it through the patrols. Lead the way, Jack. I won't take the accursed oaths. We need to check the garage first. Rats. I hear them in the walls. Scratching. Yes. Scratching. from the jail all the death a police whistle hmm could prove useful a pistol and a shotgun at last The 
door handle is missing. <sighs> that was too close. We've got to be more careful. I won't be able to open it from this side. Look everywhere! We've got a better chance of staying alive if we try to sneak past them. Somehow. I fear! Lost them. 